The concept of alternate might be a little bit tricky. Alternate is where you switch. So when you're looking over here at alternate interior and alternate exterior, first notice on this one that my transversal is this line right here. That my two lines that it's intersecting are actually going the other way from some of the previous examples. So when I'm looking for interior angles, interior angles 2, 3, 6, and 7. They're on the inside of the two lines that are cut by the transversal. Now, alternate interior are going to be ones that are on opposite sides of the transversal, but you're going to be going from each intersection. So that means that 6 and 3, see how they go across? So angle 6 and angle 3 are alternate interior. Also, going the other way, is 2 and 7. So angle 2 and angle 7 are alternate interior angles. Now your exterior angles are 1, 5, 4, and 8. Now we're not looking for the corresponding angles, which would be in the same spot, but we're looking for the ones that cross over the transversal. So in this case, it would be 5 and 4 would be alternate exterior angles. They're on the outside, and they alternate over the transversal. So angle 5 and angle 7 alternate exterior angles. And then on angle 8 and angle 1 are also alternate exterior angles. So they go from one from each set of intersections and they alternate over.